Hey guys, Rabbit Your Girl here. Today we're gonna I'm gonna show you something that I figured out. Um, the other day I showed you guys my my um my quills. I did a little update on my quills. And basically, um, I told you guys about that quill that only had one foot. And basically today I came outside like every mornings I came outside. Um, I saw it. It was totally dead, totally dead, totally dead. It was dead in the ground. So I went inside, I grabbed them with the towel, and then I got them out. But um, this quail is going to help, help me a lot on the food. Not for me, for for the quails, for other quails. Um, I saw these two videos on YouTube about, I think the channel was Food for Thought. Food for Thought and um, Justin Rhodes. Um, very, very, very famous people on YouTube. I really, 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 really like them. Um, they have great ideas, great opinions, great advice. So that's really good about about, the, about people on, on the channel. They give advice to other people that just started YouTube or don't know really about quills or really don't know. You guys are great people. But um, I saw their video of, of um, they got a dead something and they put it inside a bucket. Basically, uh, the flies come and they they put maggots in the in the in the bird and the dead bird or dead whatever red, dead rabbit whatever you whatever whatever dead thing animal you have. Basically, you put it in a bucket. Flies come, put maggots. The maggots quail eat maggots apparently. Um, so that's basically what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna show you the quail right now. So if you're a little bit skirmish about dead animals, please turn off your phone or go to another video because I'm going to show you this quail um, just a little warning right here I'm telling you guys so um, turn the camera and I already warned you guys so if you want to watch this it's your choice <laughs> it's your choice so here we go basically I have the quail inside that bucket um, there's a bunch of bunch of flies on that bucket right now. Um, see the little flies running right there, flying. But basically, there's a lot of flies in there. I didn't put holes. You're supposed to put holes on the corner of right here, right there. You're supposed to put holes, but um, I didn't put holes. Um, I'm gonna do it in a kind of different way. So, because I'm not gonna put it inside their 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 coop, I'm just gonna let leave it right there. And when I have a lot of maggots, um, of course I'm gonna I'm not gonna cover it or anything or anything like that, for the flies can come in and stuff. So there's a dead bird in that thing, that bucket. So I'm gonna show you guys it. There's a lot of flies. It's funny because. All the people that have raised animals, rabbits, pigeons, doves, quails, sheep, any animals, any form of animals, or any, like, I'm not sure of dogs, but like, any animals, when they die, they stink. <laughs> they really do stink. That's why I'm like, I don't know, like, like, three feet away from it because it really stinks. Not even three feet, like, two feet away from it. But... They really sink. I'm gonna show you it, so cover your eyes. Here we go. Okay, guys, here we go. There's a the dead bird. There's hell. There's hell of flies, so I'm like shaking here. Although I'm not scared of the flies, but like the flies been in this bird, so it's kind of gross. But there it is. Even bees on here. I really do hate bees. There it is, guys. I'm gonna put it over here because it stings. It's not gonna stay here, but I'm just putting it here for the video. Guys, but oh my god. That stings. Alright guys, uh thank you for your advice. The YouTube that I just um shout out. Um, thank you for advice on this. I think this will really help on my quills for they can eat some live animals. 
Um, some people have been asking me for the mealworms. Guys, I didn't have any patience with them. I don't know why, but I just gave it all to them and they ate it all. I didn't have patience with the mealworms. They were not, they were not changing. Like they were, they weren't not changing. They were just mealworms, and I don't know if I'm doing it right or wrong. But I just think this way is gonna be way easier and more animals for free. So I think th this thing is way easier and more, more cheap to do this way. Um, so I'm just gonna do this way. I'm not gonna get more. I might in the future, but not right now. I'm just gonna get with the maggots and stuff and give maggots to them. So, um, so yeah, guys, pretty much it. Um, oh, you guys already saw my dog's haircut. She is so cute. Luna. Hey, baby, you so cute. Yeah, you are. It's his cheekies right here. Cheekies. Cheese. Hi, Mimi. It's so Chickies and Luna right here. That's basically it for this video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. And let's see how the maggots go. So gross. So gross. So smelly. Alright, guys. Have a great, great day. We have the quills here. Um, we actually hatched a lot of quills today, so can't wait for you guys to see that video coming up real soon for you guys. All right, guys, have a good day. Goodbye.